Make online easy with these 10 tips. These 10 tips to make online easy will help you establish some simple habits that will make your online business life less stressful. There tend to be so many roadblocks that we come upon when we first venture online, whether for recreation or business, these tips can make online easy to traverse and instill a greater feeling of confidence, particularly when you have just begun an online venture. Most roadblocks can be easily googled for solutions, but this can take extra time and energy and lead you on a bit of a wild goose chase if you don't know exactly what you are looking for. The 10 tips to make online easy will save you some time and frustration, most definitely if you are a new entrepreneur. To be most effective, when going through this list to make online easy, be sure to favorite each website mentioned or implement each tip as you go through the list. So many times we will come upon some terrific training, read through it and then never get back to the article or site to actually put the material to good use. Point 10 tips to make online easy when working on choosing a domain name always do thorough keyword research first. Use Google AdWords keyword tool to determine if the masses are actually searching for the keywords that you are choosing for your domain name. When you find a keyword that is getting a lot of monthly and global searches, search it on the main Google search page to see how many other sites there are that carry those keywords. If you place the keywords in quotes, e.g. keyword and the resulting sites is less than 5,000 it will be a good keyword to use. Lesser search results are even better. Discovering keyword analysis rank is extremely important for creating anything for your business, articles, videos, ads, and domain names. Yes. An autoresponder is a must-have in online business. It is imperative to automate your marketing systems to build a list for your business and build relationships with those on your list. It is also very important to personalize your emails. If you have purchased email swipes or generic messages, it is crucial to your business to personalize them. People want to feel like they know you before they can trust you and share a relationship with you. A generic message isn't going to provide your contacts with the real meat about you that they need to make a decision whether they want to begin a working relationship with you if you haven't yet created a Facebook vanity URL for pages yet or any other URL that is extremely long and cumbersome, you can use Bitly or Tinyurl. Both the sites allow you to input your lengthy URL and at the click of a button they are shortened for you and easier to use where less keystrokes are crucial, like Twitter. Be sure to always use a personal signature in your emails. Add in your blog address, social media sites, Skype ID, email, and phone number. It is always a good idea to use a tagline too, something catchy for others to remember you by. You can create an email signature in your email settings. Google search email signatures and you will have your choice of a number of different email signatures that can be free or a paid service with linked tabs and interactive pictures and animation. If you are trying to keep your Facebook personal profile completely separate from your business page, then you will know it is difficult to have your Twitter posts appear only on your Facebook page and not your personal profile. Selective Tweets is an awesome app that will post tweets only on your business page and not your personal profile, just by adding hashtag FB to the end of a tweet. In this way, you can keep your Facebook personal profile non-business for your friends, while still using Twitter to post all your business details. As you are adding friends to Facebook, save them in groups of 20. Facebook won't allow you to send mass emails to your friends anymore, you have to add them individually to an outgoing message. If you already have them saved in groups of 20, you can send an email to the whole group, which is an exceptional time savings especially if you have 1000s of friends. Tweens is an awesome free site to get more fans for your Facebook page and more followers on Twitter. Here you can generate points, or seeds, when you like other fan pages and follow other Twitter accounts. You can search for your desired niche in 5 different categories. A WordPress.org blog is necessary if you want to have plugins on your website. There are endless plugins available for WordPress blogs and many of these really are necessary to the success of your business, social media links, share tools, link cloakers, etc., and for crucially important search engine optimization. So if the battle you've been having is WordPress.com versus WordPress.org, I hope this has answered your question.
Here are some awesome points on marketing with video. Always place your main business address, URL, first in your YouTube video description box. Don't forget to list your tags, or keywords, and do videos in series to keep your viewers coming back. Use the acronym VIEWFUEL, which contains the eight key elements for an extremely popular, hopefully viral video. Automated submission software for your articles and videos will make your life so much easier and you can get it for free. There are numerous sites that will auto-submit your articles and videos for you for free and you will save hours and hours compared to what it would take you to submit them individually. Only Wire, Tube Mogul, and Pixel Pipe are just a few that are excellent, trustworthy services. Sell to yourself. What does that mean? If you are doing affiliate marketing, you are probably wondering where online marketers get their affiliate badges and widgets that they place on their blogs. The interesting thing that a lot of new entrepreneurs don't realize is that a high percentage of all products have affiliate options. Many of them you don't even have to purchase to become an affiliate, just visit the site in questions and click on the affiliate sign up tab. Once you sign up to become an affiliate you will be provided with an affiliate link and badge for your blog, place the code in your widget area of your dashboard, and quite often a professional capture page. It is quite important to remember then to sell to yourself first. If you know that you need to sign up for an autoresponder for instance, sign up as an affiliate first and then you can be your first sale. Bonus tip to make online easy always feed yourself with empowering, educational, and spiritual training and never, ever, ever give up. Remember the inspirational words of Henry Ford if you think you can do a thing or think you can't do a thing, you're right.